We're going into Matayahu, chapter 7. I love this one. 7 is one of my favorite numbers. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Do not judge, lest you be judged. For with what judgment you judge, you shall be judged. And with the same measure you use, it shall be measured to you. And why do you look at the splinter in your brother's eye, but do not notice the plank in your own eye? Or how is it that you say to your brother, let me remove the splinter out of your eye, and see, a plank is in your own eye. Hypocrite! First remove the plank from your own eye, and then you shall see clearly to remove the splinter out of your brother's eye. Do not give what is set apart, Kodesh, to the dogs, nor throw your pearls before pigs, lest they trample them under their feet and turn and tear you in pieces. Ask, and it shall be given to you. Seek, and you shall find. Knock, and it shall be opened to you. For everyone who asks receives, and he who seeks finds. And to him who knocks, it shall be opened. Or is there a man among you who, if his son asks for bread, shall give him a stone? Or if he asks for a fish, shall he give him a snake? If you then, being wicked, know how to give good gifts to your children, how much more shall your Father who is in the Shamayim heaven give what is good to those who ask him? Therefore, whatever you want men to do to you, do also to them. For this is the Torah and the Nebim prophecy. Enter in through the narrow gate, because the gate is wide, and the way is broad, that leads to destruction. And there are many who enter through it, because the gate is narrow, and the way is hard pressed, which leads to life. I, uh, and there are few who find it. But beware of false prophets who come to you in sheep's clothing, but inwardly they are savage wolves. By their fruits you shall know them. Are grapes gathered from thorn bushes or figs from thistles? So every good tree yields good fruit, but a rotten tree yields wicked fruit. A good tree is unable to yield wicked fruit, and a rotten tree to yield good fruit. Every tree that does not bear good fruit is cut down and thrown into the fire. So then, by their fruits, you shall know them. Not everyone who says to me, Adonai, Adonai, shall enter into the reign of the Shammai'im but he who is doing the desire of my father in the Shammai. Many shall say to me in that day, Adonai, Adonai, have we not Nabu in your name and cast out demons in your name and done many mighty works in your name? And then I shall declare to them, I never knew you. Depart from me, you who work lawlessness. Therefore, everyone who hears these words of mine and does them shall be like a wise man who built his house on the rock. And the rain came down, and the floods came, and the winds blew and beat on that house, and it did not fall, for it was founded on rock. And everyone who hears these words of mine and does not do them. She'll be like a foolish man who built his house on the sand. And the rain came down and the floods came and the winds blew 
and they beat on that house. And it fell. And great was its fall. And it came to be. When Yahawasha had ended these words, that the people were astonished at his teaching. For he was teaching them as one possessing authority, not as the scribes. <laughs>